Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So when we do look at the price chart of NVVE stock, it's been falling down, which we can clearly see. But now some sort of support formation is happening. And I'm talking about the very near term price action. And the validity of the trend or the range is completely based on the price and its stability. So if NVVE stock you know, continues to trade and sustain above the support level, we can then expect some sort of bounce back. But if it does not, then obviously things goes, uh, I would say, on the downside. So first of all, 0 0.10 is the level that we are going to look at as far as the lower end of the range is concerned. So don't go below 0 0.10, otherwise a downside will start again. Right now, what is active on the upside is an uptrending price action and it is in between or it will be in between 0.23 and 0.31. Now, I don't want to go beyond this range just for the sake of, uh, you know, understanding. You need to understand that the stock has been going down and it is happening within the range. So unless there is a breakout, we can't go beyond the range. Now, there are two possibilities from here on. Number one, the stock may move like this and then you will have a downside. That's first possibility. Number two, there will be a big momentum. That is second possibility. Number three, the stock is unable to move and somewhere down the line, it fizzled out and started trading lower. So there are two possibilities on the downside and one possibility on the upside. And that is why it is very important for you not to go beyond the range and let the stock decide where it wants to go, where it wants to go. The, you know, uh, when we look at the current price chart, what we can see right now or in front of us is a, a bounce back and that bounce back is very limited and it is solely dependent, uh, depending upon the price and its sustainability at or above 0.10 or more. So this is the end of the video. Thanks for watching.